Good morning, friends. Good morning. Welcome to your first day of virtual preschool. I have a friend with us. What kind of friend? What kind of animal is my friend? He has pretty long legs. You got it, a frog. My frog friend, his name is Mo. Can you say Mo? Can you say hi, Mo? What is Mo wearing today? He is. And do you see Miss Lori and Miss Allie wearing something like Mo too? We definitely are because we are close to each other so we want to be safe and healthy right welcome to school today i have all my friends names and i'm going to show you and when you see your name i want you to say here right who is here today and i have a picture too to go with this friend Yusuf. Who is this? David. Hello, David. How about this friend? We can see her. Yes, that's my friend Ria. These are all our new friends. Someone else. This is Alexa. Yep, Demarcus. Whose name is this? Jaden. Someone else. Ayana. How about this name? Daniel. We have a few more. Ryan. Oh, I have a picture with this friend. Who is this friend? Her name is Emma. Just like my daughter, Emma. And did you know our friend, Jaden? Miss Lori has a son name. Jaden. <laughs> How fun. All right, I have two last friends. Who is this? Brooklyn and Amir. Those are all of our friends in preschool. All right, how are you feeling today? You have a chart that looks like this in your bag of supplies. You're feeling angry, put up one finger. You're feeling sad. How many fingers should they put up, Miss Lori? Two. Two fingers. If you're feeling tired. Three. If you're happy today. Four. Four fingers. And if you're excited. Five fingers. So show me, how are you feeling today? I'm excited. And Miss Lori is happy. happy, happy and excited. All right, you have something else in your supply bag. They look like this. Did you see these? Try to find your sticks. One stick says yes, and the other stick says no. I'm going to ask you a question, and you can show me no or yes. All right, Mrs. Lori, what is our question today? Are you excited for virtual preschool? Show me with your stick. Yes or no? I'm going to answer yes. It looks like Mo wants to answer too. 
What would you say, Mo? Are you excited for virtual preschool? What did Mo say? Yes, he is excited. All right. Well, we have a story, two special stories. One story is called School is a Little Different This Year. Miss Lori is going to read our story about how school is a little different this year. School is a little different this year. At school, we will learn new things and have fun. But it's a little different this year. Some of the teachers and students have face masks or shields on. Even though they have a mask on, they still care about me, smile at me, help me, read to me, draw with me, play with me, listen to me, teach me, and love me. Some days I do school from home, which can make me feel sad. My teachers and friends miss me. I miss them too. Sometimes I feel nervous or worried because it is a little different this year, and that's okay. I can tell my teacher, and she can help me feel better. Even though school is different, I can still have fun and learn new things. Very good story, Miss Lori. Thank you. All right, what are you excited about to learn and do this year in school? Sounds exciting. All right, we're going to take a quick little movement. I need you to, if you're sitting, I need you to stand up. And this is called a pencil jump where you get really, really still. And you're going to make your hands look like the point of the pencil. And you're going to make a big jump. And you're going to do it five times. Can you do it with me? One, two, three, four, five. Did you make it? Were you straight like a pencil? Excellent. All right. We have a story called Pete the Kitty's First Day of Preschool. Is it your first day of preschool too? It is. This book is by Kimberly and James Dean. Today is a big day for Pete the Kitty. It's going to be so cool. It's his first day of preschool. What should Pete bring to school today? He takes pencils, glue sticks, a paintbrush, and crayons too. Of course, Pete's favorite color is blue. He runs to put everything in his new backpack. Pete's backpack is really groovy. He picked it out himself at the store. Have you ever picked anything out new at the store? Exciting. Now it is time to head out the door. So Pete is going to his school, but you get to stay at your house and do it from the computer. Don't forget your snack, Pete, says Mom. Pete thinks a banana will be an awesome snack. The school bus stops in front of Pete's house. Pete gets on the bus for the first time. He knows just what to do. His big brother, Bob, rides the bus too. You don't have to take a bus to school this year. Bob walks Pete to his classroom. Are you nervous, Bob asks. No, says Pete, I'm cool. See you after school. Pete meets the teacher. She wears glasses and has lots of style. Welcome to preschool, she says with a big smile. 
Miss Lori and I are smiling, but you can't quite see it, but we are smiling. At story time, Pete's teacher reads a book about a mouse who loves cookies and a cat who loves his shoes. Pete loves cookies and his shoes too. Next, it is time to paint. Pete paints a blue kitty as happy as can be. It's almost snack time. Let's wash our paws. Pete eats his bananas. He eats every bite. Yum. That is just right. Now it's time to sing. Everyone gathers round to sing their favorite songs. Pete loves singing along. Who likes to sing? Do you like to sing? We'll make sure we have lots of songs this year in preschool. Soon it's time to go home. But Pete isn't ready to leave. He loves reading, painting, snacking, and getting to sing. Preschool is awesome. Pete loves everything. Mrs. Lopez's preschool class. The end. All right, boys and girls, we will see you tomorrow morning for another meeting.